first year we dug really deep into our um, data to find out who our dropouts were, how old they were, what grade they were in, what time of year, and what kind of things that told us. And what we were astounded to find out was that over 60% were freshmen sophomores. You just can't look at or report, oh, this one's doing bad. You need to write down every single person, how many credits they're at, and then sift out, okay, these, these are on track, these aren't, these is, this is who we need to focus with in, or those kids that are marginal, kind of the seesaw. They'll also need to identify those kids. At the end of every school year, we sit down and make our at-risk group, our list of students. The last two years, there's been a really strong push of getting kids in credit recovery during the school year, and then if they don't make enough credits, getting them into summer school. If you take the time to dig out all the data, it will reveal things that you didn't even think existed. Just because you base a lot of things just on your perception. We can't do that. You've got to use the hard data to make your decisions. What the student outcome is, that's the most important thing. And if we're not getting the outcome that we want from our students, well then we need to reconsider what we're doing and maybe do something a little better. For more stories of champions, visit americangraduate.org.